Hello, good morning, Sudoku friends. Welcome to the May 27 art version of the New York Times Sudoku. We'll get started right away. There's a nine blocking up and over one of these is a nine and therefore one of these is going to be a nine. An eight must go in one of these two squares. We can see that already. And we can see a nine blocking down and down and across here. So here's a nine. There's a four, seven, and a nine, and they need to go in these squares here, don't they? The nine and the four both could go here. Let's see where that takes us, because if these have to be a uh, seven, four, and a nine, then these must be a one, five, and an eight. Therefore, these must be a two, three, and a six. So a two must go here or here, and therefore here or here. Yes, I think that is correct, but the time will Tell I also see two fives here and here that might be significant later on. I don't know. But while I'm thinking about that, this nine blocks across, so does this, and this nine blocks up, so here's a nine. This nine blocks up, this blocks over, this blocks up, another nine goes here. And we are back to the two nines here. There's only one three in this puzzle so far. I'm getting some coffee. I'm back. Where were we? We were I'm intrigued by the one five and an eight here because that will give me a five down here somewhere. One would block up and one blocks over. So one of these is a one blocking down. This one blocks down. So one goes here or here. The four blocks down. I'm inclined to say that the four and the seven will go up here, but I'm not sure. So I'll think about something else for a moment. One thing that comes to mind is that if these have to be a two, three, and a six, we have a six and a two here. Can we do anything with that? I think we can, because two, three, and a six here, here, and here, we can only have a three or a six because we cannot have a one, two, four, five, seven, eight, or nine. So yes, these three squares are a triple, two, three, and a six. And that leaves us a one, eight, and a four for these squares here. We know that this must be a one or an eight because there's a four already here. Ah, and there's a one and an eight here. So here's the four. Excellent. Now we have a one, eight here, and a one, eight here, and a three, two and a six here. So does that give me anything except a lot of talk? Well, it gives me a six here, but that's uh, besides all of the other stuff we just talked about because this square cannot be a one, two, three, five, four, seven, eight, or nine. Yes, so it's a six. Excellent. So now one of these must be a six, and this is a two or a three. This six blocks over, so does this. So here is a six. That gives me a seven down here somewhere, and because the seven blocks are crossed, so one of these is going to be a seven. And the two, the two also blocks across here, so one of these is a two, and therefore we need a two for one of these squares down here. 
an eight must go an eight can't go here or here it also cannot go here because an eight must go in one of these squares here and the eight also can't go here so here's an eight now we got an eight in one of these squares we still need a three and a five to complete the row can we do anything with that i don't think so so that gives me an eight here or here But I'm intrigued with these squares here because we know that a one, we talked about this, a one blocks up and over. So one of these is a one and therefore one of these is a one. And we have an eight here. I'm thinking about the one, five and an eight here leaving me to find a nine four and a seven now we have a seven here so seven goes up here somewhere so this square must be a five because the five blocks down here a possible five here and here blocks down here so here's a five that is i think correct now we're looking at a one four and a nine for these squares the nine blocks it down so here's a nine and we now have our nine up here and here's a one and a four this is a two or a three and this is a two or a three and now we know of course that these two squares must be a four and a seven this one blocks over so here's the one this is now a two and a three across here and that the two blocks across this two also blocks across a while this a two blocks up so here's a two we talked about how this two blocks here and we need a two here or here and therefore in one of these squares down here now we got two twos blocking down so here's a two now a seven must go here or here because this seven blocks over here this seven blocks over here one of these is a seven and one of these is a seven therefore we need a seven in one of these two squares in order to have a seven in column two at all a six blocks up this six blocks up and this six blocks across so here's a six across here we are going to need a one four three and a seven this is a four or seven we know that so a one must go in one of these squares and actually a four can't go anywhere but here here or here and i'll tell you why because we know that one of these is a four it blocks this square this four blocks this square and this four blocks this square so one of these has got to be a four one of these must be a one so this is a four or a three seven four seven four three i'm thinking that this square must be a three or a seven because it cannot be a four we just talked about how a four must go in one of these squares down here right and all other digits but the seven and the three are pointing to this square here and we got the exact same digits blocking here so this is a except for the one of course so this is a one seven three and believe it or not this is a one seven and a three if you don't believe me i'll do a quick count but it is uh, it is true this square cannot be a one it cannot be a two it could be a three but it could not be a four because a four must go down here it cannot be a five six it could be a seven but not an eight or a nine this square can be a one but not a two it could be a three but not a four four must go down here not a five not a six it could be a seven but not a nine and an eight 
And it is exactly the same. It can be a one, but not a two. It could be a three, but not a four. Four must go down here. Not a five, six, nine, or eight. So here we've got a triple of a one, seven, three. And that gives me down here an eight, four, and a five. Let's look at the other digits now missing. That's a two, three, and a seven. We know that these have to be two and three, therefore this must be a seven. Now we got a seven in this square here. What does that tell me about these three empty squares? They must be a three, five, and a six. Six here or here, five. Here or here, three. Mm. I really don't know. Two, three, and a five here. I thought this would be easier now. We found the triple up here. Ah, but we know that this is a seven because we talked about how seven must go here, 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 or here, leaving only two squares available for a seven in column two. Right now we got this seven. We know that this is a seven. This is now a 1, 3. So 1, 3 here, 4, 7, 8 here. 1, 3. Of course, we have the 1 talking over. I'm a bit slow this morning. That makes this a 3, of course. And now we have only one square missing here. That is a 4, and therefore this must finally be the 7. Up here now, we need a 4, 5, and a 6. Six and four here, so here's a five. Here is a four blocking up, here's a six, and here's a four. This must be a three and a five. The five blocks over here is a three, here's a five. We know that a five had to go in one of these three squares. We can now have got two fives blocking over, so here's a five. These have to be a one eight pair. Three, five, and eight for these squares here. There's a three and an eight blocking. Here's a five. This is a three and an eight pair now. So that means an eight must go here or here. Here we need a two and a three. The three blocks here, so here's a two. And therefore, this is a two and this is a three. Here we'll be looking for an eight and a six. The six blocks over, of course. So here's the eight, here's the six. And now we know that this is a one and this is an eight. We now have an eight here or here and here or here. That makes this an eight. These must be a five and a four. And these must be a seven and a three, three blocks down. So here's a seven, and that makes this a seven. And this was a three, right? Now we got a three blocking down and down and over. Here's another three. Here's the eight, and therefore this is an eight, and this must be what? Did we talk about that at all? I don't think so. These must be one and fours. The four block over, here's a one, here's a four blocking up, here's a four, here's a five blocking down, here's a five. This must be a four, therefore this is a four and this is a one, this is a one, two, three here, two, three, six here. Oh, we got the two blocking over now here and the six, so here's the three making this a three and this a two and this a two and this must be a six yeah that was a very fun puzzle today i enjoyed this puzzle finding these triples here and these triples here actually helped me a lot solving this puzzle i hope that you liked it as well and that you'll come back for more soon thank you for watching and bye for now